Hey y'all. So today we're going to make some sugar cookies with uh, some Jiffy Mix. And I'm going to get the uh, recipe off the backs of the box. I have all of my stuff out here already. So here, uh, two cups of the baking mix, two thirds cup of sugar, a third of a cup of milk, five tablespoons of butter softened, an egg, and we'll add a teaspoon of vanilla extract. So that is the basic recipe. I'm going to try to add uh, maybe some almond slivers to the top because this is just a basic sugar cookie recipe and I just like to put a little something on there. So um, once I get it all mixed I'll probably add a little bit of um, almond and I also have some shredded coconut that might be good on that too so we'll see how it goes. Alright, so let's see how the recipe reads out. Alright, so we have our um, baking sheet here and we've got the oven preheated to 350. Now it says just combine all the ingredients until they're blended and then drop them by the tablespoon onto prepared baking sheet. And then we'll cook them for 8 to 10 minutes and uh, it says here that we should sprinkle them with sugar afterwards. So let's put everything together and get a move on. So we're going to add the sugar, the butter, and if y'all thought it was hard for me to get that butter softened, <laughs> I live in Alabama and it is hot. So no, it's not hard. A third of a cup of milk. I'm gonna crack this egg in here. Come on. And then we're going to put a teaspoon of vanilla in there. Oops. That's all right. There we go. All right. That's the oven preheating. All right. Let's get this just kind of mixed up a little bit. about all the mixing I'm going to do with this here. This is supposed to make 24 cookies, but I have a feeling it'll probably make a little more because I don't make my cookies real big. got now. So we got our mix all mixed up here. Here's our baking pan. We get a spoon. Let's see. Okay. There's some slivered almonds. And we'll sprinkle those on top as we get them done. Okay. Put them out like this. Make sure you space them because they'll spread out a little bit. It's 
would be an easy recipe to make with your kids. Not a lot to make a mess with. Doesn't have a lot of prep time. Put another pan in there. Okay, let's move this out of the way. I'm just gonna put in a few on the top there like that. Now if you wanted to add sprinkles or whatever, chocolate chips, Reese pieces. Um, anything like that, now would be a good time. Alright. I like almonds. So. so, almonds it is. Okay. Alright. Put some, take it. I've got it here. We're just gonna put them in the oven. All right. And we're gonna set the timer for ten minutes, and we'll see you uh, when they come out of the oven. Okay, y'all. So we got the timer going off. And let's turn that off. See how they look. Ooh, they look good. All right, so let's take these out. And I need to reset my timer because I got something else in there. Okay. Now, we're just going to take them and sprinkle them with some sugar. I hope this is coming out all right. But, uh, almonds look pretty good too. So we'll let those sit for just a minute and cool off. And uh, then I'll put them on the cooling sheet or the cooling tray. And uh, they're good to go. Thanks for watching the video. And if you like what you saw, subscribe to the channel and hit the like button. And everybody, have a great day.